Uh, third video in Silky Picks, I'm going to try something a little bit different. I'm um, just doing a quick tip. Um, quick tips will be shorter videos that go over just one small aspect of Silky Picks that may not be immediately obvious. And the one I want to go over today is that the sliders uh, in Silky Picks all seem to have, you know, they have limits top and bottom um, in uh, exposure, in white balance, in the contrast. Uh, but many of the controls can actually be lifted or dropped below the maximum or above or below the maximum value. So if you need more contrast, if 2.5 is not enough contrast, which is as far as you can drive this slider, you can use the um, uh, buttons here or you can type in a number to, to use values that are higher or lower than what the sliders allow. And there are still some hard limits, but they're much higher than uh, what the sliders would make you think. Um, this is true in the white balance. You can adjust the color temperature and deflection above and beyond what you would expect. Um, the contrast tools, exposure tools, you can go up to plus or minus eight. Um, and there are other, uh, some of these other subcontrols as well. And there's a little bit of maybe uh, trial and error, seeing which ones you can move beyond the, the expected values and which ones you can't. Um, but just so you know, um, if you're feeling like you're limited by the sliders, Remember, you can always use the, uh, again, these plus and these little arrow bracket keys or by typing in a number, uh, get beyond what you, were, what you were previously limited to by the sliders. I hope this helps. I hope this was uh, informative for some of you. And uh, feel free to uh, leave any comments or likes um, at the bottom of this video. That's the feedback I get as to whether you like these or if you prefer um, the longer ones that I've done earlier.